Hello and welcome back to the Unboxers and today we have for you another Ninja Turtle and it is Creature from the, the Black, Black Lagoon. Lagoon Ultimate Action Figure Leonardo yes. as. <laughs> so this is a crossover mismatch however you want to say it of uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and Universal Monsters and this figure is by by NECA all right so ooh, look at his tongue inside there Blah. yeah i was really excited when i saw them announce this because when they fit when they did the first wave and they had all four turtles i assumed that they were done mm -hmm. and they didn't do creature so i didn't think there was going to be any chance and now i guess this is wave two because they're starting to come out with new monsters so this was really exciting because creature's one of my favorites awesome okay so let's take a look at the box the side and the other side oh and the back oh that looks awesome tilt it just a little bit there's a little glare all right there we have it says um real creature feature oh. it's a real creature feature wave your nerves goodbye dive into pure terror see the splashing see the slashing splashing sensation from the deepest depths of the sewer packed to the gills with <laughs> with what is that spears, spears and, and fears. fears leonardo as creature from the black lagoon so are these um from the first wave the pictures um some of them i'm not sure how they split them up oops but um but yeah the the wolfman and casey jones as the phantom i think are newer yet to come all right let's open up the cover and whoa look at that very cool um figure inside i mean like you know pose of a fig of the figure and look at the little fishing hook on yeah the um net caught around him that's really cool looks like he's gonna come with his own previous yeah. turtle and um oh a spear with a fish on it and some other cool stuff. Looks like maybe a couple hand sculpts, feet sculpts, feet sculpts. Um, but anyway, he looks really cool. So let's go ahead and get Leonardo as the creature from the Black Lagoon out of this box and give you a much closer look. We'll be right back. All right, so there's Leonardo as the creature. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at what he comes with. So um, he comes with the turtle. I guess we can start yes. right there. The turtle that he comes is, with his own turtle all right so there's the turtle it looks just like him <laughs> before he changes from the ooze all right and then he comes then with have like oh what is that this is um hold on let me move this all right okay so this is like his like a skeleton hand because of course you know they only Oh, yeah. Have like the couple fingers, but so this is like the the one the fossilized one from the movie. But then they also make it so you can clip it onto his wrist and make it be like a weapon. Oh, huh. That's so awesome. they kind of make it a dual use. All right, and then he comes with a couple extra sets of. Is it just hands or hands and feet? Just hands. Okay. So there's this one, which is more like um. I guess open hands, but open maybe maybe hands. relaxed. I'm not sure exactly <laughs> what the relaxed creature hands would look like. And then <clears throat> more like reaching or swimming hands. So they're like the fingers are splayed open. It's got all kinds of like the little details on the inside. Awesome. So very cool. All right, and then he comes with extra accessories that could attach to him. Yeah, I left them in the bag because they're pretty small, but it's Tiny. like fish hooks and bobbers and like fishing line and that you can, I think, hang, hang from the uh, oh, yeah, from his, his little netting. net. Yeah. That's cool. All right, so let's take a look at the creature himself. So let's see. Here's the facial sculpt. <laughs> Very cool. Got his mask on, got his big um, creature lips. Yeah. <laughs> Red and uh, fish-like lips, should I say. And it's funny how they did, like, the... Even, like, this is... Um, like, the tassel that comes off the back of his mask uh -huh. almost kind of looks like fins. Oh, yeah. 
That's cool. <clears throat> That's neat. Um, and then the spear. I guess if you want to take it out. Of yeah. The so these are like his, like the versions of his um, katanas, but of course they're like uh, spears. So one has like a piranha stuck to it, <laughs> and cool. then just a empty one. But it's cool how they kind of. Yeah, because the um, <clears throat> the party's holding looks like a sword. Yeah. Like a sword handle. So that's cool. And then uh, let's take a look at the netting that goes around his torso. Very cool. And I love that hook just hanging there. So that hook is molded on, looks like. Yeah, there's a hook and a bobber and, bobber and another, another one. Another hook on the back. Ooh, look back at here. His shell. So he's yeah, got, he's got like, like fossils. fossils. He has fish on his <clears> shell. <throat> That's very cool. Even like it looks like a fossilized mm -hmm. version of his own hand. Yes, it is. Very cool. All right. And then, um, yeah, look at his gills. It's neat. Like up to the side oh, of his yeah. head. All right. Yeah, there's the gills, the different layers of gills. And then his fin going down the back. It's pretty cool. And then the net is kind of hung on it. Which yeah, is I love all the... And it's almost like maybe like a... Um, Slowly iridescent, mm -hmm. kind of. Kind of looks like it's got like a shine to oh, it. Yeah, yeah, a little bit of shine. Um, and then the yellowy, um, green yellowy <clears throat> shell um, on the front. You know, the front of his shell or the underneath, which would be the normal turtle shell. Yeah. Um, it looks pretty cool. I like all the fins on the back of his legs, creature fins. Yeah, he's even got like like more or maybe like extensions of the fins on the back of his legs, like on the back of his feet. feet. <laughs> That is pretty neat looking. And yet, he still has his um, knee pads. Yes. Knee protection, so. And they will, like, move, so. It's oh, look at that. Pretty neat. Very cool. All right, go ahead and show off his articulation. All right, so he's going to have a point at the head, so he can look from side to side. Uh, he can look up and down as well. Uh, he has articulation at the shoulders. And it will uh, rotate around like 360 as well as extending. He has the double elbows and then the uh, dual wrists. So they will bend um, as well as rotating. Um, he doesn't have, obviously with the shell, he's not going to have a point in the waist. or, But he does have articulation at... The hips and of course it will kind of go it's limited back to front but um, it will go out side to side pretty well he has uh, the knee articulation and then the ankle and the ankle will pivot and roll so very cool just an absolutely awesome looking figure and so glad to add the creature to our uh, NECA TMNT monster crossover collection. Alright, so there's one last look at Leonardo as the creature from the Black Lagoon. So thank you so much for watching. As always, come back and see us, like, subscribe, and we will see you next time.